Matthew 3, 1 through 12. I'll be reading from the message. Thunder in the desert. While Jesus was living in the Galilean hills, John, called the baptizer, was preaching in the desert country of Judea. His message was simple and austere, like his desert surroundings. Change your life. God's kingdom is here. John and his message were authorized by Isaiah's prophecy. Thunder in the desert. Prepare for God's arrival. Make the road smooth and straight. John dressed in a camel hair habit, tied at the waist by a leather strap. He lived on a diet of locusts and wild field honey. People poured out of Jerusalem, Judea, and all the Jordanian countryside to hear him and see him in action. There at the Jordan River, those who came to confess their sins were baptized into a changed life. When John realized that a lot of Pharisees and Sadducees were showing up for a baptismal experience because it was becoming the popular thing to do, he exploded. Brood of snakes! What do you think you are doing slithering down here to the river? Do you think a little water on your snake skin is going to make any difference? It is your life that must change, not your skin. And don't you think you can pull rank by claiming Abraham as father? Being a descendant of Abraham is neither here nor there. Descendants of Abraham are a dime a dozen. What counts is your life. Is it green and blossoming? Because if it's dead wood, it goes in the fire. I'm baptizing you here in the river, turning your old life in for a kingdom life. The real action comes next. The main character in this drama, compared to him, I'm a mere stagehand will ignite the kingdom of life within you, a fire within you, the Holy Spirit within you, changing you from the inside out. He's going to clean house, make a clean sweep of your lives. He'll place everything true in its proper place before God. Everything false he'll put out with the trash to be burned. 